Hello. Today I will show you how to repair Razor Kraken X broken USB cable connector. Very simple tutorial how to replace damaged USB connector and fix these Razor Kraken X USB gaming headsets. This way you will save time and a lot of money without buying new headphones. Last time I showed you how to replace the entire USB cable if it is damaged. This time, let's replace just the USB plug. The following tutorial will be useful for repairing any USB cable for headphones, mouse, keyboards and other equipment. As always, you will need a soldering toolkit to do this job, remember that you can only do this if you are over 18 or have a grandmother close by. Some heat shrink tubing will also be useful. You can see where the problem is with these headphones and why they don't work. The leg got caught behind the cord and the USB connector was knocked out, good thing I didn't damage the USB socket of my grandmother's gaming laptop. This USB plug is completely dead, so bought a replacement USB connector, which we will install in the damaged place. Start by cutting a few centimeters off the damaged USB plug. Then, from the beginning of the cord near the headphones, take the cord and pull it slightly towards the end of the cable, so that the outer rubber jacket is stretched. This will straighten the excess rubber. Then cut the outer cable jacket with a sharp paper knife, but be careful not to damage the inner wires. Separate the wires of the cable shield and braid one core wire from these shield wires. Then remove the foil shield from the center wires, it can be wrapped around the shield wire or cut off. Separate the existing four wires. The USB cable uses four wires instead of three, unlike the 3.5mm jack connections. Then remove the ear pads of the headphones, you need to get inside the headphones to make sure where each colored wire is soldered. Unscrew the headphone case and open the housing. As you can see, there is no NASA technology. Here you can see which color wire is data plus, data minus, 5 volt power, ground and ground shield wire. Once you have taken a picture or written down the wire colors, you can close the headphones and screw them back together. And put the ear pad cushion back on if you have problems with it. Click more from Tech C screw and watch a detailed video tutorial on how to replace and put back Razor Kraken ear pads. This is a replacement USB connector. And this is the USB connector color contact wiring, this you must know. The next step is to check if the USB connector housing can be closed, as you can see, my cable is a bit too thick, so with a sharp paper knife cut a bigger hole for the cable. At the moment the cable fits very well in there. Cut off a small heat shrink tubing, which you put on the USB plug housing at the end. Stretch the cut piece with the pliers a little bigger and put it on the cable. Then tin all the wires, so that they can be soldered to the USB connector in a more comfortable and qualitative way. Also tin the USB connector contacts and tin the location of the shield ground wire for soldering. Put the wires in the color order in which they need to be soldered to the contacts, solder all the wires, just be careful not to short circuit. Solder the shield ground wire last, cut it shorter if necessary. For safety, check with a multimeter that no short circuit has developed. Then cover all the contacts with grandmother's nail varnish to prevent future short circuits. Then use super glue to fix the USB connector housing, the cable, and also glue the USB housing together, and clamp it tightly together. Then apply more super glue, and put the heat shrink tubing over the top. Then take a larger heat shrink tubing, stretch it even larger and put it over the top of the whole USB connector. And do the same again with the larger heat shrink tubing. Here's the result. Your repaired Razer headset will be good as new and you've saved money for your friend's Friday pizza party. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to post them below this video. As always, my grandmother and I would be delighted if you like this video, and hit subscribe so we can meet up for other useful headphone repair videos. But now back to gaming. 